I first thought about being Santa when I was about six and we were in a shop down in Birkenhead and they had a grotto and I thought one day I want to be Santa Claus. Hey ho, I'm Santa, I've been for the last three years. Believe it or not, when I first started in Panto, I was one of the evil villains and I can't even remember his name but I had a terrible laugh. <laughs> and now I'm... Oh, oh, oh. My preparations for becoming Santa, they begin around about June each year. Because believe it or not, I, I think it's better to have your own beard than it is to use a fake one because so many beautiful little children like to swing on Santa's beard and I don't fancy it twanging into my nose. The best, best by far thing about being Santa is the happiness I bring to people. I met the real Santa three years ago and he didn't have to say anything he just let me know that you're being Santa on behalf of me do your best I worked for the council for 37 years in total um, but I've done everything I've done uh, I started off in the computer teams be the chauffeur attendant to the mayor of world I've been a magistrate for 21 years now and I was the toastmaster as well I also became a licensing enforcement officer but unfortunately seven years ago I had a heart attack and a stroke and it was quite a serious one was paralysed all down one side, it took a long time to come back, even to talk. So now, I've found what is perfect for me. With limited mobility, I can sit down and I can give something back to the children. Would you like a candy cane? I've also been to Chill Factory in Manchester where I went to open their grotto. And that was fantastic, but it was very cold and very damp because they had us on the ice. There was no floor to the grotto, and the grotto was built on the ice, so we really chill factor for, for, for Santa. He almost had chill blains. It was great, though. We had a fantastic time. I'm now retired, and my future, I'm going to continue to be Santa for as long as the children want to smile with me. It's going to be fantastic. If I could ask for any presents at all, that's a better glowy nose for Rudolph, because he's always running into telegraph poles and things when we land. But... The main thing I would really, really love is for everybody in the world to be happy and healthy.